Hello, this is Sister Lisa again with Pray My Purpose and Power. Now, this is the first day of April. Yes, and this week is Resurrection Sunday. Thank God Jesus died for my sins and he covered me in his blood and he was resurrected from the dead so I could have life, go to heaven, and enjoy this abundant life he gave us. Amen. Well, this month we're going to be talking about self-love. Yes, I've been doing some study, and the Lord has revealed to me uh, some of the, the problems, the misconceptions, and the distorted view of self-love. And people talk about, I love myself. You should love yourself. Let's show love to ourselves. Love our bodies. Love our color. Love everything. But, uh, nah. There's some, you know, uh, problems with loving yourself way too much. And, you know, um, it comes against the love that God states in his Bible. Because his love is unconditional. See, the love of Jesus saved us this week on Easter week, not the bunny and the chocolates, none of that. But he, his love, that's the love. And that's the love we should show to ourselves and others. So we'll be talking more about this this month of April. Um, look for content on that. And also, just to let you know more about Praying with Purpose and Power. And, of course, my YouTube channel. And, of course, I'm on Instagram and Facebook. Uh, it is a ministry God birthed through me um, in terms of prayer. And in terms of realizing that prayer will help you with every spiritual matter, issue, or challenge you face in your life. And also to have understanding of spiritual truths that is in the world, that's in your life, that's in Christianity, or any other aspects of life that God reveals. And he reveals through his word, his perspective, because God, he got a perspective on everything that's happening in the world. The good, the bad, and the ugly, and unrighteous, and ungodly, and a lot of stuff. So I teach on different spiritual matters, Bible truths, as led by the Holy Ghost. So I just talked about the Holy Ghost, right? And so he may, you know, give me some insight on different, you know, issues that's come up, some controversies and some trends. But it always is going to be related to the Bible. What is God's viewpoint on this? What's the prophetic word on this particular situation? So God has a word, you know, and Bible truths based on this self-love that I keep on seeing all over. And there's our spirits behind self-love and self-love can become perverted and distorted if it's not aligned with the love that God has for us and Jesus who when he died for us that kind of love because that's the love we should show to ourselves and to other people so keep looking out for content keep praying with purpose and power and subscribe to my YouTube channel you see it on Instagram you can click on my link you can click on my bio you can click on my website praying with purpose and power dot we believe dot com and also just look out for me on tiktok because i just got on tiktok praise the lord because we're doing the work of the evangelist we gotta reach all souls we got billions of souls that need to know jesus so keep praying with purpose and power and check me out starting next week bye bye